Hello guys and welcome to Pokemon Ruby Let's Play Part 1. This is my debut episode. It's uh, kind of going to be awkward because it's my first time, but you know what? I'll get better. As you saw in the original video, it had bad audio and it wasn't even in the very beginning of the game. So, I decided to redo this to make it really good. And I hope this works out just great. Alright, so we're going to begin here. And we're going to have Professor Birch here welcoming us to the world of Pokemon. And this is on an emulator of Visual Boy Advance, and I can super speed by pressing spacebar whenever I want to. Well, well, well like that. And I don't, I'm not going to do that too often, because my friend told me not to, so yeah. Alright, so, I, I'm the new kid on the block, so hopefully I can eventually become as great as Munching Orange, and Super Skarmory, and Blue Zephos, and all sorts of people like them, because I will be doing Minecraft, Pokemon, and any other Game Boy Advance game I feel like doing, because I can. Alright, so first off, my name is going to be, uh, just like my, um, YouTube name, Katana, or Katana Thunder. Katana Anime is my gamer tag on Xbox, so yeah, we'll start with Kato here. Just cuz. <clears throat> Alright. Oh, okay. Your Kato is moving to my hometown of Little Root. Hometown of Little Root. I get it now. Alright. Your adventure, your own adventure is about to unfold. Take courage and leap into the world of Pokemon where dreams, what world of Pokemon where dreams, adventure, and friendship await. Well, I'll be expecting you later. Come see me in my Pokemon lab. Alright, Professor Birch. I will do that and I will become a master of all Pokemon. Let's go. Super speed. Yeah. Alright, I can do whatever I want to. Kato, we're here, honey. Oh, man, my mom's irritating. Why am I in the back of a moving truck? I know everybody complains about that, and I am too. It must be tired riding with our things in the moving truck. Well, this is a little root town. How do you like it? This is our new home. It's a quaint feel, but it seems to be an easy place to live, don't you think? And you get your own room, Kato. Let's go inside. Um, I get my own room? What? Why is there a Machoke over there humping a TV? Oh, man, this is bad. What has this game come to? Oh, all right, I gotta go set a clock now. Mom, if I have my own room here, do you sleep in the kitchen? Because that's what you do all day is the kitchen. Oh, well, I'm not going to complain. I get my own room. All right, up here we get a bed. One bed. Your mom does not get to sleep. She sleeps in the kitchen. She's a slave. Yep. One potion here. Alright, now we'll go set our clock for the first time. Get to set a clock ever in our life. It's a new clock. Um, yeah, it's fine. Alright. Mother, why are you running into my room without knocking? Kato, how do you like your new room? Good, everything's put away neatly. They finished moving everything in downstairs, too. Pokemon movers are so convenient. Oh, you should make sure that everything's all there on your desk. Well, Mom, um, I think you should go clean the TV there. That Machoke was doing some naughty things on it. Yep. Okay. Oh, Kato, Kato, quick, come quickly. What? Oh, oh, God. That come quickly. Oh man. Interviewer, we brought you this report from in front of the Pedalbird Gym. Oh, it's over. I think Dad was on, but we missed him. Too bad. Oh, we don't want to watch Dad anyway. Sucks. Oh yes, one of Dad's friends lives in town. Professor Birch is his name. He lives right next door. You should go over and introduce yourself. I don't want to introduce myself. I want to go to his lab and steal a Pokemon. Super speed here with my super speed button. Yeah, all right, never mind. Uh, all right, I want to go steal Pokemon. Let's go steal a Pokemon. Dang it, there's no Pokemon here. Oh well, we'll go meet his wonderful daughter named May because she will be our love interest in this story. Oh yeah. May ah oh, no, her mom. Oh hello, and you are. Dot dot dot. D d dot dot dot. Oh, you're Kato, our new next-door neighbor. Hi! You have a daughter? Or, we have a daughter about the same age as you. Our daughter was exciting about making a new friend. Our daughter's upstairs, I think. Well, you're weird. You have a strange voice. Um, yeah, I'm running away. Let's see. Oh, hello there. Hello, fine lady. Let's look at your map here. Alright, so this is where you lost your virginity here. And... This is where you had your first kiss, and this is where you you do your prostitute things. Oh wait, what what am I talking about? May doesn't do those kinds of things. She just has fun with Pokemon. Take that whatever yet way you want to. Oh, you're Kato, so your move was today. 
Um, I'm May. Glad to meet you. Uh, May, it's not glad to meet me. I know what you want to do. You don't have to hide your hidden feelings for me. That would just be so weird. I don't care, May. I just want to get my Pokemon and go on my adventure and conquer the world and become the ultimate evil mastermind of Team Magma. Not that I'm a member of Team Magma or anything. Just that my clothes are red and black like theirs and I, I prefer fire Pokemon over all else. Um, I definitely ain't a member of Team Magma, no sir. Uh-uh. Ah! Time to go steal our first Pokemon. <gasps> Professor Birch, oh no, you're getting attacked by a Poochie and I'll save your life. Hold on, hold on, man. I'll get this Torchic here. I'll speed through this with my superpowers. Yes! Okay, never kid. I'm just kidding, guys. We're just gonna kill this Poochiana with our Torchic and we'll join Team Magma in a few minutes. Don't worry. This isn't the end of the world, guys. It's okay. Oh yeah, Torchic got 15 Experiantos. Professor Birch, woo, I was in the tall resting wild Pokemon when I was jumped. You saved me, thanks a lot. Oh, hi, you're Kato. This is not the place to chat, so come by my Pokemon lab later, okay? Alright, I'll, I'll just steal your Pokemon. I'm not gonna, I'm definitely not stealing this Pokemon for you. Even though you say you're doing me, I obviously stole this, so don't tell, don't say you gave it to me, because I stole it. I stole it with my bare hands. And I think our Torchic's name shall be Atlas. Atlas Flame Dragon, even though this isn't a dragon, it's more of a chicken, but you know what? Chickens evolve from dinosaurs and dinosaurs evolve from dragons, so you know what? Atlas Flame Dragon, here we are. Yeah. Yeah, buddy. That's a fact, Jack. This is so wonderful, I have to get all the way up there. I don't feel like walking, so I'm just gonna... I don't think y'all will mind if I super speed this unless you don't want me to. Whatever, I won't super speed. I'll be a good let's player and let y'all watch me walk through tall grass and kill little baby Pokemon. I mean, their parents just leave them alone to die. It's not like I, it's not my fault they get killed from my ch miniature fire chicken. My, I mean, it's just a fire chicken. It's not gonna hurt anybody. Looks around suspiciously. All right, fire chicken. Scratch its eyes out and make it bleed. Bleed, it's a go bleed. Oh no, no, things go no, you died. Oh no, I'm gonna go to jail now for killing out innocent Pokemon. Pokemon jail is for losers. I'm too cool for school. I don't go to school, I'm 10 years old. I'm too cool for school. I just go around and capture Pokemon. That's right. I will kill all the Pokemon, conquer the world, become the champion, and be the master of all things. That's my goal in life, is to be a Pokemon master for Team Magma, of course. No other, no other evil organization or good people. I, I'm a, I'm a criminal in this game. I'm a ten-year-old criminal. Too cool for school. Katon Thunder. Yes. Even though it's summer, I don't go to school in the summer because I'm obviously an American. If you can't tell by my accent, unless you want me to be Japanese. Hello, hello, hello. I am, I am Japanese, not Javanese, Japanese. Hello, hello, me and my Pokemon, Pokemon Monster, Ruby version. Ruby version, though, is that how you say it? Never mind. Let's super speed through this little person here. Super speed, all right. Whoa, let's go battle May for the first time ever. We'll super speed through here in the tall grass and kick her bloody rump. Y'all thought I was going to say something else, weren't you? No. No. Well, scratch him up. Yeah, buddy. Mudkip, you look oddly familiar. Are you a Power Ranger? No. No. I'm kidding. He's, she's not a Power Ranger. I got 69 experience, though, so that's a very nice number there. <laughs> 69 experience points. I must have had 69 experience there. <laughs> Take that whatever way you want to. I don't know what kind of people watch are going to be watching my videos, but I've had 8 views on the bad audio one, so I must be kind of popular. I must be like a million subscribers by now. No, I'm just going to have one subscriber currently when during the filming of this. Uh, my friend, he subscribed me because I told him to. Yep. 
That's right. I got one subscriber. Yep. Weep. Weep. Enjoy that I have one subscriber. Ha ha ha. Yeah. Alright. So, first part of our video is almost complete. We're just going to go back to the lab real quick, grab our Pokeballs, grab our Pokedex, and then I will sign off for y'all. But I will also be making a part two right after the filming of this, just for y'all. Don't worry. You you won't be left in the dark. I, I swear, I won't leave you alone. I won't leave you alone forever. <laughs> I, yeah, I'm not really crying. Y'all thought I was crying, didn't you? Oh, man, it's so sad. Shut up. Shut up, Birch. I don't care. Whenever my kid catches a rare Pokemon or courts its dad in the Pokedex, why may it look for me while I'm out doing fieldwork and shows me? She shows you. What does she show you? Oh, her Pokedex. I, I thought she was talking about something else. Oh, man. Oh, okay. Oh, wow, Kato. We got a Pokedex. Blah, blah, blah. Shut up, man. You're annoying me. Just give me my ball. Just give me some balls. Let me give some, get some balls and let me leave. Shut, shut up. Just let me give my balls and leave. Thank you. Thank you for that encouraging moment. Give me my shoes, mom, mother. Give me my shoes from Shoe Carnival. Because Shoe Carnival is where I get my shoes, obviously. Give me some Asics. Super speed. Yeah. Yeah, buddy. Shut up, mom. Alright, here we are. We can now run. And we can run and super speed. How awesome is that? Alright guys, this is Katan Thunder signing off. Thank you for watching part one of Pokemon Ruby Let's Play. And adios amigos. Uh, por favoro. Yeah, I don't know.